today. Today's uh, our code day, um, computer science education week. So we had a lot of activities today. One is uh, we had a, a company called Super uh, install one of their benches in front of the school. To, it has a solar powered uh, charging device on it where students can sit on the bench and charge their cell phones. That was installed today. That was part of the activities. Uh, so we had uh, students working throughout the school. We have about 800 students working on uh, computer science uh, coding activities. Uh, but we also um, walked the mayor through uh, some of our engineering spaces and showed them some of the projects the students were working on. The new economy, the innovation economy, uh, we need to prepare kids for that. We need to uh, develop spaces that look like the spaces they're going to be working in in the future. Uh, so we need to give them the tools that they uh, will be using in the future and, and train them properly on those and think about doing things differently and uh, coming up with new ideas and being able to, to try and uh, take their idea and make something like it. I'm a uh, alumni of the John Neal Bryan School, class of 2015, and I'm, I'm a freshman at MIT. I'm planning on studying mechanical engineering college, and um, this space, this maker space, helped me a lot on like, give me like a facility to make um, fun, like fun projects, and like like the solar panel you see outside there. Um, I was the captain of the MIT MIT men team. I was a senior, and we built an autonomous solar panel cleaning system, which is really cool, and that definitely helped me get to MIT. When I graduated from MIT, um, I actually, it's kind of funny, I had two offers, one to work at a company in Connecticut and one to work with uh, Ed, Ed Moriarty from MIT, and he told me I would get to work with the O'Brien and, and with students just like me who are pretty much going through this engineering program, and I thought that was really exciting because education is one of my passions as well as engineering, and here what we do is we help students pretty much take their projects and make it a reality. Um, I've been coming back and helping out with all of those programs and then at the same time we get these students into MIT, into our Saturday program, into our summer program and it's so nice for them to have someone come here who has gone through the journey. They know now what it takes and also they can stay connected with a school like MIT um, and know what it takes in order to get in. So it's really nice for them to pretty much have someone in the classroom who can help out with that. It makes it more of a reality than a dream.